and make money! Happy New Year! <laughs> Now that we got that out of the way, that I'm the most important right. person. Let's it, get started with this me, video. Actually. So anyways, as you guys saw from the title, this video is going to be a New Year resolution video because it's the new year and we got to be on our grind. Like 2020 was a hell of a year for a lot of people. So we got to raise the standards for get 2021 paid, and make it a good paid. year. Now we got our <laughs> bubbly, our, what is this? The great, red grape. Mm -hmm. I read great sparkling Welch's. Mm -hmm. Yes, jolly. And our 2021 glasses. So we'll be sipping on this throughout the video. But we're, we just already made a list. We do this every year. We make a list of our resolutions and we put them on the fridge so we can see them every day because somebody like me. So <laughs> we put them on the fridge every day so we can view them and continue to work on our goals all throughout the year. So do you want to like go, then I go, yeah. alternate? Yeah, you can go first. Then. Okay. So the most important goal that I feel like I had that I made sure I put number one was financial stability and credit score. <laughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> I feel like finances are always important. Every year you want to try to get to the next level and credit score. You can't do nothing without credit. And with us trying to have some major plans coming up towards the end of the year that I got listed on here for later, uh, uh, we need to up that credit score and up that financial stability. So I want to keep building my account. All right. What's your number one? How many goals do you have first? I have 13. Okay. I have 16. You just tried to. Yeah. I'll listen to her goals. Go ahead and do your one through five. <laughs> <laughs> no, I actually changed them. They're different. No, I, I'm looking at your list. It's not different. But no, I changed it though. So you do your one. And now I'll do my one through five. They don't get to know it. I just did my one. You want me to do one through five? Oh, no. You you did your one? Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. My one is save more money in my checking account. You <laughs> All right. Go ahead. Okay. So my next second goal is going to be straight A's my last quarter of rec um, lecture. So it's my last quarter in my therapy program. So I'm trying to make all A's. Hopefully I can do it. I be stressed. Girls be knowing when not to talk to me. <laughs> but I be stressed. I'm going to try to make all A's because this is my last quarter before having clinical. So hopefully I can do it. All right, my number two is save more money in my father's account. <laughs> Why are you telling people what your bank is so they can steal? They don't know my name. <laughs> all right, so my... Hers is basic, y'all. This is going to be my video. So my third goal is to be more consistent with Forex and YouTube. For those of you who don't know what Forex is, it's basically trading. We it's still don't exchange. Yeah, trading. we still don't know much about it because we signed up for it in like September and haven't done much with it at all. So I want to get more consistent with that and definitely more consistent with uploading YouTube. As you can see, we're trying to be consistent. Like we're filming this video on the 29th. We're being consistent. Like it's going to be up before the first. No doubt. Me. <laughs> My third one, save more money at Bank of America. Anyway, <laughs> my fourth one is to graduate, y'all. I finished my program in September, and I am so, so excited because I'm going to make money. So I'm excited to graduate and be done with school. Well, my fifth goal is going to be for you not to hurt my ears no more. My fifth one is to save more money. In our joint, no, that's my fourth one. My bad. In our joint accounts, I didn't tell them whatever. Oh my gosh! All right, my fifth one is to be a better partner to my wife. I love you. Mm. <laughs> oh, I love how you live. <laughs> All right, my fifth one is to save more money in my savings account. I told you her one through five would save more money. <laughs> Can y'all tell she a broke girl? You a BB. Or oh, I'm a cheap and we're cheap. You a Jason Pitt. Yeah, because he was a millionaire, but was cheap. <laughs> All right. All right. So my sixth one is to mend relationships. Woo 
there are some relationships oh, that need to be one. mended. I'm not going to say too much on that, but I'm going to try to mend some of those relationships to my best in 2021. Ho hopefully. First of all, this is a champagne glass. Second of all, you don't drink champagne like that and pour it around like how you do wine. I could do that. I want to do. This is a flute glass. I need some more. You're six. You won't have any more. You shouldn't have finished. My sixth one is to work out. More. Cause girl, this bag, you about to be single, baby. This oh, baby. Bag. Look at your bag, Ellie. Look at you. Look at your belly. Girl, you don't have no quads. Your quads are non-existent. Just, you got back rolls. You got belly You got rolls. back rolls. You got love handles. Yeah, that's better than you looking like Mrs. Claus. Anyways, okay, well, I guess you saying them. Ho, 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 literally. Yeah, no, you the ho, 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 this relationship. <laughs> All right, so my next goal is, I doubt it's going to happen. COVID. COVID, but it was to travel some more. We still have not got to travel anywhere, like, on a plane, out the country, or out the state. <laughs> but that's one of my goals for next year but that may or may not happen because of covid yeah oh yeah i'm seven yeah my seventh one is to maintain a healthier diet so i could be eating right we already eat pretty healthy though it's just that like my metabolism is still really high so i eat in bigger portions but she's helping me fix that i'm starting to eat like less and stuff so yeah what i always say to you She'd be like, um, oh my goodness. I can't think of it. I got a, I got, I, it's right over my tongue. I got a, I got a pace. Pace you? Yeah, she's like, I couldn't think she's of like, it. She's like, I'm pacing you. I'm just, I don't want to be paced. I want to eat. She got so mad when I had people over and I said that in front of them. I was like, I got to pace you. Here's two pieces because of chicken. we grown. My girl sitting here telling me, babe, I have to pace Well, baby, you. I'm going to leave you if your rolls keep on coming. So, <laughs> you may want me to pace you. <laughs> okay. Next. Baby, you got the girl I met. <laughs> <laughs> that is me. You yeah. going to love me regardless. But look at If I look like Respucia, you supposed to love me. I'm going to love you from a distance. I shouldn't be saying that. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't mean no harm, y'all. It was just a joke. Anyways, my eighth goal for this year is to drink more water. Y'all, I cannot stand water. It does not have any flavor whatsoever. Like, I have to put lemon in it. I have to do something. It's just, it's this, just disgusting. Yo. There are a few occasions where I can drink an ice cold glass of water and be like, dang, that was good. And but. That's on a hot, one of the hottest days in August. Mm -hmm. I'm going to tell you right now, that same goal is going to be on for, there for 2022. <laughs> she, no, that's it not was on last year's goal. She's not going to drink more water. Mm. And you be getting on me, but I really do drink a lot of water. You're not supporting me. You're not being a supportive girlfriend. I am, but I know you. It's not gonna happen. Well, your role's not gonna go away. <laughs> and neither Next are yours. yours. Go. Yeah, I don't even know what number we on. But we on eight. Well, just look at the last thing you said and say the next one. I want to volunteer more. That's the eighth thing on my list. I think I'm about to get hiccups. What volunteer work would you like to do? Um, can I just can I go ahead and skip you and do my nine? Cause my eight and nine kind of go mm -hmm. together. My I, my eight was volunteering, and then my nine was help the homeless. And anyone who knows me knows that like I really love feeding homeless people. When it was cold on the year, I got them like some blankets and stuff like that. She really but, will. We were going <clears throat> in. What the nail salon? Yeah. And she went in Dollar Tree and somewhere else and got them some blankets. Not was it Kirtland? No, not Kirtland. It was, what's that? The fabric store yeah. that was right there. I can't I, think the name of it. But. Joanne. Yeah, that. That's what it was called. But I really love doing stuff like that. Like, even if I don't have it, which, like, we're, we're in school. We're both full-time students. So our finances may not always be right, but I got to always. Make my sure finances are up to par. I have six figures in my bank account. I don't know about you. Why well, did you pay that off for me? <laughs> but yeah or here you have got to stop knocking on the table for the sake of the video oh don't nobody want to hear all that in their ear well, nobody want to hear you yelling ah! <laughs> <laughs> all right so my
my ninth goal is to exercise and do more yoga. We started, we are so inconsistent. We started doing yoga um every morning. Well, we for did like a week. We no, but we did it for like a month. We did not do it for yeah, a month. We, right, we did it for like three weeks. Don't be hyping it up. We did it for two. No, I think, was, I think it was the high. I think it was like three weeks. We was getting up at like 6.30 and stretching and doing yoga and we stopped. So it's I want to get back know, into. Up, you know when that bed, you feel it's so good. And in, in the, the winter, winter, it's cold. And it's, yeah, in the winter, it's cold. And if you sleep on somebody, y'all all cuddled up because it's cold. You, you know, don't be cuddled up with me. Yes, I do. You be turned away from me. <laughs> you turn away from me every night. <laughs> But she interrupted my time. But, good, good but I want to exercise because, y'all, this gut is getting out of hand. Um, I used to be a cheerleader in high school, and I'm losing all my flexibility. So I do want to start doing yoga so I can become more flexible. I just want to be healthy all the way around. You can go again because I want to hear it. Oh, okay. So I don't – they have seen my natural hair. So I want to grow my natural hair out longer. That's my 10th goal. Um, 2017, I cut my hair. It was down to my belly button, but I cut it because I've always wanted a bob, and I just finally, I was going through some things. Okay. Yeah, I got a whole tattoo and cut my hair. Midlife crisis. <laughs> it, it, how are you, 23? Yeah, <laughs> but I cut it, and so now it's probably about to here, I think. Hold up. You didn't just get a tattoo, y'all. She got a big tattoo. That's how you take up the whole top portion of her back. <laughs> <laughs> but go ahead. <laughs> but yeah, so I think it's about to here now. I want to grow it back out and try to get it to my old length. What did you say, Dover? I think y'all told me your hair has grown. I think your hair is at least to the bottom of your breast by now. But, well, the point is I want to get it longer. And it still hasn't reached its full thickness that it was when I cut it. Like, it used to be so much thicker. But... Yeah, I want to grow that out longer, take better care of it. And it's like my curl pattern changed, too, when I chopped it. So I want to get my coily curls back, too. But when she say that, like, I'm not even trying to hype my little baby up. But her hair is still so beautiful. Like, honk, honk, don't toot my horn. It's not like, she's right. It's not like coily now. Her hair is like wavy. Hmm. It's like a, a loose curl almost. But her, the back of her hair, like, coils really good. That's my. Don't say that. <laughs> Sorry, I don't have a filter. I'm working on that. Well, it's true. But you can't say that. Oh my God, <laughs> you don't think they heard you? No. Oh, and I'm not that good at editing, so it's just going to have to be in there. If you on shade room teams, then you just on there. Well, if I'm on shade room teams, that means we lit. Because hey. this could be the one video that pop off, and you uh, got us looking crazy. Ice Cube said that all publicity is good for Diddy G said that, too. He got that from them. Who do you think is older? Ice Cube, nigga. Okay. I mean, girl. Yeah. Is it my go? Or is it still? It's my go. My 10th goal was to pay off her ring by her birthday, which is in May. Y'all, she put a ring on it. It's due. I think it. I'm, my last payment is supposed to be in December. Wait, no. No, it's, it's in August. Why am I thinking December? I guess I'm thinking December because of when I got it. Yeah. No, August, September. Well, you might as well go ahead and pay this one off because the next one you won't be paying off for a while because it's going to be four carrots from Tiffany, okay? Tiffany Bakery? They make rings? I was going to get you a little cake um, pop. Okay. I don't think y'all... Well, I know y'all haven't seen it. We haven't uploaded our Christmas vlog. I may or may not upload it. It was very sentimental. Christmas is really good. She won. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It comes hard. I came oh. hard too. It's the story behind that. We'll tell y'all that story. She can't like I'm like all the way up here. Like you can't even see the level I made. Like you can't even see it. And she was like here, and here is really high, but I was just up here. You feel me? Anyways, I made. That's not the point of this video. Okay. Go on, son. <laughs> so my eleventh goal was to become more knowledgeable about my field. Um, I'm majoring in occupational therapy so obviously my goal is to become more knowledgeable in that mm -hmm. field hey hello watch school. this what's the occupational therapy <laughs> i know what it is i'm not telling them right. <laughs> okay. i do know what it is y'all but it's just like for those who are in health professions it's like you don't learn till you actually apply it like i haven't had clinicals yet but i've learned a lot from when i worked at a pt clinic and from doing what i do now i'm a um, home health care giver so I've learned a lot from that, but I want to learn more how to treat different conditions. No, I wasn't doing that to be funny. I really was yawning. 
rude. But I'm yeah, sorry. I want to learn how to treat different conditions and more about what occupational therapy is, better ways to treat my patients. But yeah. Hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. My 11th was to become more confident in my decision making uh, because I often, you know, I decide to do things or I really want to do something and I'm just not confident while I'm thinking about doing it or you know, I don't, how do I say this? When I say this, you're going to know who specifically I'm referring to. But I really could care less what anybody think of me. But it's just certain people that I really have a hard time addressing things with. And I really <laughs> would like to do better with that. Because at the end of the day, I have to work on me. And I have to work on making myself happy. And I have to deal with things that I'm still not over. So that's what I mean by becoming more confident and my decision making and that's included in the things that I say and that I believe and that I feel. But you can go ahead and do your next one because I only have two more left so you can get down to two more. Okay. And then my twelfth one was to self educate and Yeah, I'll be trying to preach to her that she has to teach herself sometimes. I do be preaching that to you all the time because she's so quick. Y'all, when she first started college, I felt so bad for her. Like she was stressed so much. I was like my angel she was about to email her um, professor and that's the question. I was like, man, did you look all over your portal for the answer that you're about to email? Because professors cannot stand portal. when you just email. So I was like, did you look all over? And I said, let me look at it and I will see if it's on the portal. Girl, if you don't know, in five seconds, I found what she was looking for. I didn't know how to work the portal though. That was my first semester in college is what she's talking about. Oh, you know, you should really do a video for college students. Like, just taking a step back and gathering yourself. Because you, you was, she was stressed. But I cried. <laughs> <laughs> I feel so bad for but her. Because y'all know I'm a veteran. I, yeah, she's older than me. Old head. But anyway, <laughs> no, I, I don't have that many people in my family that went to college. And I was just like... <gasps> I'm not going to break generational curses. We talking about the person who wants to go to dental school. I said, baby, you got a lot more crying in you. No, and then my, was it my first semester? Yeah, no, I think it was my second semester. I had, <laughs> I had anatomy for the first time. And I studied so hard. Like, I've never studied that hard for a test. And. What you made? Did you even make a 50? No, I made a 45. I was. I, I told her you like you cannot take that personal. I, That's just no, college for you. Let me tell you, and then it was a long class. That class was like six p.m. to ten p.m. Right. Mm -hmm. So six to eight was lecture, and then eight um, eight to ten was uh, lab. So Stop right banging after on the table so much, baby. Uh, sorry. So right after lecture, it didn't take me the whole two hours. You could leave until you know you had to go to lab. And I was like, she rolled with me. And I was like, babe, I'm about to go home. Like, I, I'm just ready to go home. <laughs> and I already knew what it was. I didn't even ask. And literally, the drop um date was like a few days before that. Mm -hmm. I mean, a few days after her exam. Yeah, and then that was COVID. So COVID had pushed our exam back because they didn't want us Your to have Your teacher class. was also just very slow. Yeah, he, he was like slow. a sloth. That's because he was one of them teachers that tell too many stories. Like how we tell too yeah, many stories. Yeah, I was going to say, it our video. All right, and then which one you at? Thirteen. Okay, and so then after that you can go. And my thirteenth one so was to increase my credit score, cause it's it's pretty good right now, but it could be better. Yeah, cause you just started working on yours at eighteen last year, so. Yeah. All right, so my twelfth one was on my list last year. Um, <laughs> it's to work on my religion, just developing a closer relationship with God. I kind of took a step back last year because a lot of things that went on with are coming out a lot of things went on that made me i didn't come up last year straight away from religion just because i didn't feel like <laughs> y'all get what i'm saying anyways next <laughs> my 15th one was to catch up on bills because <laughs> your girl been broke this year and that tuition, that tuition be looking kind of suspect, boy. So we're going to get that paid off. All right. Baby, you ain't been paying that tuition off for years. But I'm saying, like, get it back on track. You, you feel me? My last and final goal is the biggest goal of 2021 since I'm graduating. Y'all should know. 
what it is, what every adult does. Not every adult, but go ahead. <laughs> with every 25 year old not every 25 year old but you need to stop saying stuff you <laughs> <laughs> well what most people's goal in life is to have we're outgrowing this two bedroom apartment so drum roll please i want a house so that's my goal um definitely to start working on it since i graduate in september definitely to go ahead and start looking at houses and hopefully have like paperwork started by the end of the year so that way we can move in fresh january but hopefully move in by the end of the year by maybe like october november so we can celebrate our first christmas in our home that would be exciting but if not yes that is definitely the goal all right and my last and probably second most important goal the first one is to save money <laughs> is to do well in school. I have an overload schedule this upcoming quarter, so I really have to be focused. And last quarter, my GPA dropped a little bit. I'm doing it soft. I'm just touching it. You can want <laughs> <laughs> So I really want to get my GPA back up because my when I first started at my new school, I was getting all A's. I had all A's two quarters in a row. So I got to get that back right. I mean, you didn't make it go under. I mean, you're nah, still, it, it is. You're still above a three, so you're good. Yeah, I know I'm above you're a three. You're just not at 4.0 no more, but you're good. Yeah, but I want to get it back to like, I I mean, obviously. You want to be honors? Yeah, I know it's not going to take one quarter. I'm going to have to be consistent from here on out. It's very playing. easy to drop your GPA. And very hard to bring it mm -hmm. back up. Like a C can do a little damage. Yeah, and that's what it did. <laughs> but anyways, anyways this is the end of our video thank you guys for watching you're gonna have this up before 2021 and happy, happy new year, year. <laughs> <laughs> so we hope you guys enjoy this video we're gonna try to be more consistent i know we always say we're that's gonna be our more favorite consistent. quote boys and it doesn't happen but it's gonna happen because 2021 is that year we're gonna run up a bag Want up a check? I'm trying to be going in Chanel this year. We can go there, baby. You just couldn't get none. Well, I'm trying to be buying some. <laughs> and when COVID over, I want to take my trip to Honolulu so I can go shopping because they got all the stores there. I want to go back to Cali so I can go to um, the sneaker store. The sneaker store. The well, if you want to go, we got to run this for it. So. But I told you, when I go, we're not going. We can't bring no luggage because I got to have all my luggage space to bring all my shoes back. I guess we're going to go empty-handed. That's the trip that you... Because you, she said she wanted to go on a trip where we didn't take any luggage. Mm -mm. I just want to go to the airport and be like, all right, I want to go somewhere. I didn't buy all new clothes when I get there. Like, I feel like that's going to... For me, that's going to be like, oh, you made it. Like, you nice like that. I mean, obviously, I think we should take, like, bras and stuff because we may not be able to find that we like or not. Yeah, I guess you're going to be grandma on it. I'm, I can go get me some boxes at Walmart, girl. You know, ain't no thing. Grandpa, mm -hmm. come here, girl. Some grandpa box. <laughs> come here. <laughs> <laughs> but alrighty, hope you guys enjoyed the video. We will see you guys in a few days with our next video, y'all. I'm about to start off the interview with some bangers. <laughs> she don't even know what's going on. What the hell are you talking about? Bye, bye. Y'all say tune in. I got y'all. Bye. What you talking about? Hmm? Come on, some pranks. With some gifts. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs>